Hello Riverdale, Mr. Peppy here for another episode of Roaming Riverdale, the hottest show in town. Um, I am very happy to introduce you to one of our new staff members, even though it's late in the school year, but we have Miss Claudia, Claudia Kachike with us. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Come on, we're going to start walking. Sure. Um, have you watched any of these episodes? Oh, yes. You think they're good? They're awesome. Awesome, awesome. So, thank you for joining us. Thank you. Um, you're part of the transition of introducing Riverdale to all of our new staff members. So, we're going to try to do that this spring um, and fill the rest of the year with, with new teachers, which is great. So, you started here in September. Yes. I know we met in the summer a bunch of times when you went through the interview process and we're happy to have you on board. Um, tell us a little bit about your background in education and what exactly you're teaching. So, I started as elementary, early childhood, uh, special ed teacher mm -hmm. in Patterson. And then I moved to uh, Paramus, where I did uh, the middle school. Mm -hmm. And I also had experience teaching at high school as well. All right, excellent. So right here at Riverdale this year, you're teaching Spanish four and five? Four, five, four honors, and five honors as well. Okay, very good. I wish I knew Spanish. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> um, so tell us, so you've been here for eight months. What's one thing that you've noticed that stood out at Riverdale compared to maybe other districts you've been in? Honestly, I love the kids here. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, kids are great everywhere. Uh, also, the uh, the administrators, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, they're, they're flexible, they're easygoing, um, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, excellent, excellent. Um, what about, so you have children of your own? Yes, two kids. Two kids, all right. What's one of the, your favorite things to do with them outside of when you're not here? I like to take them for a walk. Mm -hmm. uh, we like to go for walks with stroller. I have a 10-year-old and a 1-year-old. Yeah, yeah. And it's a busy, busy, wow, right, busy yeah, time. You're busy, you're busy. Yes. Well, you're right outside your classroom here. Um, and so just, you know, we end the segment usually with the fast five. Sure. Right. So we're at that time. Are you ready? Uh, si, sí, claro. Okay. <laughs> um, favorite, uh, what's your favorite food? I love seafood, salmon. Mm, okay, all right, very nice. Uh, favorite color? Pink. Pink, all right. Favorite uh, level to teach in Spanish? Mm, I like the higher levels because mm -hmm. of my master's in Spanish literature, mm -hmm. but I enjoy also the middle school and the high school, okay. any yeah. level. Any level, good. Um, and What's uh, what do you enjoy going out with your kids? I knew that. If you were to be in any other profession other than education, what would it have been? Acting. Acting. I do it every day. I act like I like kids <laughs> and I teach. <laughs> well, you're good. You can tell you're good on camera, right? Yes. Very good. And um, one other thing, favorite season, favorite time of the year? I love the spring, mm -hmm. but I also like the, uh, the fall, so. The middle, the end seasons. Yes. All right, I'm with you on that. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. I hope everyone got to learn a little bit more about uh, Mrs. Chiquique um, and our new Spanish teacher. And if you ever want to stop by and meet her, she's right here in room 504 for the remainder of the school year. So thank you so much. Muchas gracias. Ven a visitarme. Right. Adios. <laughs> Go Hawks. Thank you. Go Hawks. <laughs>